They were going on about how their friend had gotten knocked up after going to some party downtown. They couldn't believe that she had been so idiotic about sex after about 15 beneficial relationships over the past two months. So then their boy toys jump in and asked if one of their bros might have been there that night. They found out that Heather's friend had a threesome with two of the male sluts for about three hours, doing some twisted role-playing. Apparently some fuckboys were bragging about banging and getting it raw. That's when Heather asked if they gangbanged. <laughs> she could never handle the abortion like you, Jen. Never. Did you? Yep. Sounds like someone I'd rather not meet. Could have followed through after the first punch so you could make your boyfriend reconsider her. That wasn't her boyfriend. What? I think that was an act she had over the night before. I don't know. She's. How did you ever become friendly with someone like her? I sat there for three fucking hours listening to her entire fucking life story. After hearing about the kinky shit she put her ex through, I wanted to fucking kill myself. At least I wouldn't have learned about some of the damn near illegal BDSM shit she was into. He really is a good friend. Then again, there was the one time he brought drugs over, but it's whatever. So I fun at that party. I mean, I still go to the gym with him. He did try to show me how to do a push-up once. All right, brother, this, no pecs, no sex, no curl, no girls. Oh, you try it. <sighs> Fuck yeah. All right, easy does it. Fuck yeah, we're gonna have a good night tonight. You know, you never did say a word to me after you left. I'm not saying it's your fault, but it's really not fair to have just left without saying a word, you know? You wanna know why? You're fucking asking me nonchalantly about- Come on, Jen, he apologized. He apologized? Okay, I guess he was responsible. He wasn't, okay? I didn't do it- Doesn't matter if it was on purpose or not. <laughs> you, my god, you know? Know what, huh? That you can't maintain any real relationship because you fucked some douchebag years ago? 